Back again, live in three, two, one. Ha! All right, where were we before? Uh, let's take a look. Hold enter button down while drawing or erasing. Well, we're gonna we're gonna do some things here. We're not gonna animate yet. We did copy. We did rotate. Oh yeah, we didn't do the times two. So we did do the times two, but I didn't save it. Okay, let me um let me show you one more time that. So let's do screen select. Okay. Oh, I need my sheet. Hold on. Oh, hold on. All right, let's let's do let's do the right things here. Oh, go back, go back, go back. It's 12, okay. So, so draw, and actually what we're gonna do, function select, is that it? Okay, here we go, select the function, and we're gonna try to find, let's see, where is it? Copy clear times two. Well, oh, go back, go back. We're playing a game here of let's go back, please. No, go back to the other one. Oh god, this is gonna be a fuck you, isn't it? Uh okay. So do that. So this is gonna show really quick, and then I'm gonna press enter. Because I didn't press enter before. Okay, so that's how you do the times two. I did this before, but I show you again. Here you go. So let's now do the other commands. Okay, so I accidentally erased the half face, and I don't feel like doing the process again. So what I'm going to do with this is it's a it's kind of like a profile. It looks like my face when I was a kid. So we're going to take this, and we're going to flip it over. So we're going to take it and reverse it, right? Something that you do, right? You you mirror it. So that's what we're going to do. So we're going to go and let us try that now. So what do we have here? What do we got? So <laughs> function select and draw up or down if it allows me to do that and not fuck with me. Mirror box. Go to mirror box. Go to mirror box. And, and all I have to do, okay, now we press fucking enter. So there you go. Now we'll put, uh, so there you go, that's it. So that reverses the image. So it's a very simple thing. This is so sophisticated. Imagine what could have came out. You know what I saw earlier? I saw um, the uh, somebody had the plug and plays, and you had a plug and play for Etch a Sketch, but it's just basically like a cheap version of Mario Paint. Now Mario Paint was taking Etch a Sketch to a different level, but I don't think Mario Paint was an animation thing. It wasn't an animation thing. Uh, Super Mario Maker is sort of a little bit above, but then Super Mario Maker is sort of limited in just doing Mario stuff, right? I would say that uh, Smile Basic on the 3DS is the ultimate Etch-A-Sketch, right? Because you can make anything. You can make anything of anything, but you have to know lines of code. That's sort of the uh, the UG part. If only these these units sold, because they made 2.5 million, and just for inflation, it might like, be like 5 million or more, 6, 10 million. They made so much money on the original animator but then it all flopped to shit when this when this one came out, uh, and then the Game Boy came out and that put them out of business. I mean, the display would be very similar to the Game Boy Color, Game Boy Advance. I mean, if you think about this type of screen that you see here, which is a full color display, but you have to put a light on it. This could have been the Etch a Sketch Animator Rainbow or the Animator Color Color Animator. This would have been coming out in nineteen ninety one or ninety two way ahead of the uh, Game Boy Color, All right? So anyway, let's move on. Okay, so now we're gonna go back to the star screen. 
Let's see if I can find you. Okay, that's this one here. So what we're going to do is we are going to get us to reverse the image. So we're going to create a negative, and this is the reverse box. So we're going to create... Um, a, a negative version of this, okay? So, right? So let's see what happens here. Three, two, one. Oh, look at that. So, very heavily pixelated there. You can count all the pixels on the screen. <laughs> and I believe they say that it does. if you press enter again, Something else, it goes back, but that's what happens. Um, let's see. Draw clear. Let me see. Let me try. Let me see one more thing here. I have to see. Going back. Uh, reverse box. Let's see. Oh, that's, that's, what I want to do and what really happens here. Okay, so reverse box. Sound on or off. Can I can I go back to reverse box, please? Let me see. I just want to see one motherfucking thing. And so trying to get done. It's a little workshop here. And so there you go. It reverses it back. Okay, so now we're going back to screen four. No, 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 no. Shit. I screwed up. I screwed up. Can't undo it. Okay. Draw, erase, draw, erase, draw, erase. Please. Oh, but fucking Jesus. Things I want to do and what really happens. Okay. So now I want to go back to function select. Can I do what I want? Is it going to happen or am I going to have to throw things across the room just to do a simple thing? Okay. So I think I, I have a different function here. See, there's a different function for this. Hold on. Let me check. We're trying to create a frame. Okay. We're trying to create a thick border on the screen. Okay. Okay. So now we do is Oh, that's that's exactly what I wanted to do. Oh, fuck you. Can can I do it? Okay. Well, that's what I tried to do. Shoddy attempt at this wonderful gift that we call uh, free draw. So there's also the sound for uh, sound on or off function, but we're going to ignore that. And we're going to go right to screen select. So we're going to try to build the first animation because that's what we're here for, right? And I'm going to erase everything. And... Let me see. There's an erase screen function. Press enter to clear to uh, okay. So that's that one. So you can do that. You press you press this one here. So erase screen is what you want and then you'll have a clear screen. This is just so that we can reset everything and uh and keep in mind I have no cartridges so I can't like interchange these. I wish I did. Uh so I'm going to do this again for the other ones. And let's go back to screen select. Um, where is that goddamn button at? Erase screen, screen select, function select, draw, erase. I'm trying to memorize. I have to memorize. We have to memorize. Okay, two. Okay. Erase screen. 
Okay. Now we go to screen select. Ah, uh, where is screen select at? <laughs> My missing things. And then, so I'll let you know when I, I'm um, six screens empty. All right, we've got six screens available. So what we want to do is, I'm going to draw this. So what I'm going to do, and what is the goal here? Goal is to make this guy move a little bit. Um, this is a simple six-step animation. What fun this looks like. This looks like, you know, something you'd see on, like, uh, one of those Tomogachi. So here's our Tomogachi guy, okay? Instead of a creature, it's a man. So you're ready to animate. You use as many functions as possible. So the easiest thing we could do is copy and paste and then ever so slightly change the animation so that it resembles the frames. But the first step is drawing the guy. So I'm hoping I can do this right. I pray that I pray for me anyway, you know. Um, so it looks like he's got one foot forward and the other foot back. So the right foot's back, left foot's forward. I've been drawing for a long ass time. Let's see. Well, we do need the head and neck. So that's a good place to start as Eddie. Uh, let's see if we can. Remember, we can use circles and such. Let us see the function select. And we can try it from there. Circle, 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 circle. Go back up. No, no. Uh, fuck you. Let me have my circle. Uh, okay. We got the guy's head. It's the way to get ahead. <laughs> now time to draw the face. Uh, I'm sorry. Okay. Okay. There we go. Oh, where'd you go? Go back. No. No, no, no. You had it. And you had it. Fucking shit, dude. Oh, my God. Oh, this, this bullshit. That must happen to me. Okay, hold on. Maybe I can... Okay. Trying here, failing. Now it doesn't have to be perfect the nose, but uh, let's do it like that. Uh. Uh. Okay. Well, we got that so far. Uh, there we go. Oh my god. That was a feat. Just to get the guy's head working there. That is a feat. Oh, what do we got here? Function select. Let's find the rectangle. Line, line, line. I think that's what I want. I think that's what I want. I hope that's what I want. Nope, that's not what I want. Okay. And what I'm going to do here is... Not easy doing. Come on. Okay. Uh, trying here. 
Okay. Now, 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 we have to reverse it. Oh, now we have to reverse. So, function again. We go to this screen a lot because we need to do something here. Rotate, mirror box, reverse box. Now, I need you to go to the reverse box. Okay. Okay. So now we try to... Let's see. This is going to be hard. Uh, this is the best way you can do it. Uh, oh, fuck you. Let me have what I want. No. Okay. Okay. Then you got the draw move. How does that look? Looks a little strange. Remember, you can't, there's no undo. <laughs> you cannot undo anything. Like, there's no control Z here. There's no undo. So it's going to be tricky. Um, now what I want to do is kind of move him over. So he's got a, he's got a sash across from the shoulder, but I think I can put another object and then overlap that. Because you can, you can kind of sort of create uh, quote-unquote layers. Can I move that box? Let's see if I can. Move box. Okay. All right. Moving box. We're going to move that over to underneath the head. And... Okay. Okay. Now we have the draw function again. So, these little things that may not matter, but they do matter. They do matter a lot. So, there he is there. Um, I wish I could have moved it up a little bit more, but there it is. So I had to cut down the body to, to accommodate the legs. So a little bit of customizing here. Yeah, let's try to get this going here. Can I do this right? Or is it all going to go to shit? Okay. 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 All right. Okay. Now I take this and move it over there. I think what I'll have to do here is I'm going to have to erase this diagonal section here. So let's see if I can do it. Well, I did the best I could. And there we have so far, uh, hold on. I, so there is a little bit of the drawing that I wanted to do here. I thought it was okay. It's not working out too badly. I don't stand over like this. This is kind of painful for me to do it this way, but I do it for all of you. Hopefully you appreciate it. Uh, what I'm hoping to do is get some frames of animation. Then we'll look at the different animation techniques, and then we'll go through the examples in the book, and we'll try to even do the car. That's on the uh, the front here. The goal is to kind of maybe to cement this uh, is to get to the fucking car because you got to get to the car. See the car here? The car that you see, the, the DeLorean? We kind of want to do a scene where the car goes from the background and comes out. Well, it doesn't come out. Though. That's a sketch, but comes out in a way that's really cool. So um, until the next time, uh, we'll do this on Thursday. We'll pick it up again soon. All right.